Hi everybody. Let's create this twist and zoom text animation in Canva. Start with a blank canvas and choose a background color. Now press the T key to add a text box. Update your text and choose your font. I'm going with Oswald. Now make it big and choose the font color. I am selecting this green color here. Now download this as a JPEG file. Maximize the size and quality of the image. Now delete your text from here and upload the downloaded image. Once upload, select the image and adjust its size. Now crop the images from all sides like this. Now hold the image while pressing shift and alt button on your keyboard and drag the image upwards. This will create a copy of the image in uniform dimension. Now do the same thing again. Now press Ctrl and D to duplicate this a few times. Select all and go to position and click middle. It will align all the copies. Now grab all the images and set the position you want. Press R key to insert a shape and cover the whole text from this. Change the color same as background. Press T key to insert your text. Update the font and color as you like and adjust its size. Make sure it stays inside the rectangle. Now before we move on, don't forget to join our next Canvas Canva community on Facebook so that we can all learn and grow together. Link is in the description box, so join today. Now back to tutorial. Go to the three dots to duplicate this page. Select the text and rectangle and decrease its size. Go to position and select layers. Here choose one layer and drag from its corner to reduce its size. Now select another layer and keep its size bigger than the previous one. Repeat the same procedure till the end. Now select all the layers and position them in middle and center to align them together. And then place it where you want their position to be. I am keeping it in center. Again go to the layers and select one layer and rotate it a little. Now select the second layer and rotate it farther than the previous one. Repeat the same procedure till the end. Select all the layers and adjust its size and position. Now select both the pages and press Ctrl D to duplicate these pages. Go to the second page and select position. Go to layers and choose the first layer. Go to the Arrange tab and down there you can see the rotation. Simply remove the minus sign to rotate it in its opposite direction. Do the same thing with all the layers. Once done, go to Duration and set the timer. Make sure that Apply to All Pages button is on. Go to Transitions button and select Match and Move from here. Adjust the timing and then click apply between all pages. Select all the four pages and create few duplicates by pressing Ctrl D a few times. Make sure the transition of match and move is applied between all pages. And with that, your animation is done. And here's the final look. Do try this tutorial and share your recreations in our Facebook group. See you next time.